And first tonight, we are tracking a few systems in the tropics right now. 10 Tampa Bay is your hurricane headquarters, and meteorologist Mike Prangley joins me now. Mike, there's a lot going on right now. Is there anything that we should be concerned about? Well, there's five systems, but hey, it's our lucky day because no, we're not worried about any systems anywhere close to home, at least for today. And it does look like with these systems, the overall pattern is keeping the main pattern away from Tampa and Florida. So that's good news. But look at this. I mean, this is a reminder we need to stay prepared, right? We've got five systems. Now, let's make sense of it all. The ones we're watching closely, Tropical Depression 9, uh, becoming better organized tonight as it makes a move toward Texas. Uh, notice we've got those winds west-northwest at 18. And as it moves off toward the west, it does look like it's becoming better organized. The models are in good agreement that South Texas, likely near Brownsville, could see a landfalling tropical storm by tomorrow. And if you look at the latest satellite loop here, you can see the better organization, a little more symmetry over the last few hours. So I do expect it to become a name system and it would be Harold. And the big thing I'm watching, uh, it's a very quick mover. And if anything, it's going to bring needed rain to Texas, uh, really a drought starved area of Brownsville to Corpus Christi, two to four inches. But there will be some gusty winds of 40 to 50 miles per hour. So check on your friends in Texas. Think they'll be OK. Another system to watch that could make landfall. The second of those five would be Franklin, a tropical storm. But this could likely become our second hurricane of the Atlantic season. And unfortunately, moving toward the Dominican Republic by Wednesday as a tropical storm and then maybe near Bermuda as that hurricane over the weekend. So the tropics busy, but here's the deal. Still nice and quiet at home. We take, take it day by day. And speaking of day by day, we'll have that hot Tuesday forecast coming right up. And you can stay up to date on what's happening in the tropics with our free 10 Tampa Bay app. There you can look at the latest models, see the radar and get updates on all the information as soon as we get it.